Hello Stefano, we are here with Stefano from Audio Analog. Yes. And he's right. going to show us the new product, please. Yes, of course. This is uh, the Absolute in version double R, that means uh, relay and resistors uh, volume control. That is an analog uh, volume control in practice. Uh, the advantage uh, to add uh, this board to the original one is that we replace it. Uh, the digital part with analog part based on relays and resistors and uh, basically the sound performances are increasing uh, around 20% uh, on the overall range in practice. So you have more transparency, more depth, uh, more details uh, and uh, also let's say um, even more analog sound in this case. Uh, it's also nice that gives an effect uh, of a continuous click, click, click when you decrease and increase the volume. This is one of the uh, important improvement and news that we did for last year. And also available for the Maestro. Uh, something important to say is that uh, also the existing standard versions can be upgraded to the double R version. This is the standard one, but can be added uh, the analog board like the absolute. Just a, uh, it's just a new PCB and you can upgrade. Yes, yes, we can make the upgrade in our factory. Thank you. Uh, okay. new speakers? Yes, we also have, uh, we, are, we are also introducing the new speakers. Brand name is not audio analog, but we are using uh, AirTech for these new speakers. Magnetostatic uh, technology that is two ways. Uh, part of it is for mid range uh, and also goes very deep uh, uh, for the bus, and another part is for the Twitter. Uh, furthermore, we also have uh, a traditional driver that works only as a subwoofer. The loudspeaker is completely passive and uh, the panel is very efficient because we use neodymium magnets. That means that the uh, impedance is more on and is quite stable. Sensitivity is 87 dB, so can be also uh, connected to a not really powerful amplifier. Let's say 80 watts, 100 watts, like we have uh, Puccini or Maestro Anniversary is already enough to drive this kind of speakers. And uh, it's a uh, uh, bipolar emission, so if you find a good position in the room, uh, around one meter backside and uh, uh, left or right side in practice, uh, it really gives a fantastic uh, sound stage and uh, really three-dimensional reproduction.